Hey guys, it's me again. So today we are going to do a really quick book review on Me Before You by Jojo. Uh, is it Moyes? 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 Whatever. <laughs> but by Jojo. Here we go. So like I said, today we're going to do a very quick book review. So I got to read this book. It was one of those ones where I, you know, I saw the previews for the movie and everything like that. And I was like, you know what? That looks like a good movie. I, I think I want to see it. Um, but I knew there was a book. So I'm like, I'm reading the book before I see the movie because I love to read the books before the movies to compare and contrast. But at the same time, I'm probably ruining the movie for myself because the movie's never as good as the book. The books are so in-depth and there's so much more detail in them. Love them. So one thing I do love about this book, the story. I mean, it was one of those ones that like... It wasn't like Prince Charming coming to save the girl. You know what I mean? Like there's there's always those ones where it's like, oh, the girl needs saving her. Oh, the, the guy is coming to the rescue for the girl. I'm like, it's not even the girl coming to the rescue for the guy or anything. It's a mutual mutual respect and a mutual like that, that comes together and, and they end up becoming friends and, and so on and so forth. So I really, really, really love that. So that being said, I mean... It's, it's one of those movies, it's one of those movies, it's one of those books, I was like, I could not put down. <laughs> I couldn't stop reading it, and normally what I do is I read before I go to bed, and I can like read until I get tired and put it down. It was one of those ones where I, I haven't done this in a very long time either, just because, you know, I have to adult a little bit, um, and I would stay up a really long time and finish reading, you know, the chapter, or finish reading to the part where I'm like, okay, now I gotta go to sleep. But yeah, it's it was really really good. I loved, um, I love the main character. She's just she's one of those girls. It's like super quirky, and she's someone that I would love to be a friend with. Like she's, you know, she's got her flaws and she's got her things, but she's still very strong and still very like herself. Um, you know, she's got family. Her family's not perfect, and she's got those issues, but she's still a loving sister. And it's like to see someone that still loves their family that much like in books instead of having you know where she's just like selfish and she's like no you know I want this and blah 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 and you'll you'll see what I'm talking about when you read the book um, or if you've already read the book you know what I'm talking about um just getting into fights with her sister about stuff like she was very supportive and very loving of her family which is something that I love to see in characters and I'm you know I'm not saying be a doormat but at the same time just to have that support for your family and to be able to to work hard for them as well as for yourself like I loved that about our character I also loved there's moments in it just the little banter between the two main characters just cute and funny and it made me laugh and it was the ending it was actually a surprise for me like like I said I didn't want to hear anything about it until I finished reading the book and then I wanted to watch the movie the ending was still a surprise for me and it was one of those ones where it's just like, there's so much emotion you get so attached to the book and to the characters and everything like that. When it was done, I was like, oh, <laughs> wait a minute. It's, just, it's done? And I know there's another book. It's um, After You, I think. Is, is that one? Is that the next one? Um, I'm not sure if it's a continuation or not. Um, but... I, it's one of those things where I'm like, I want to read it, but I don't know if I could go through that emotion again. <laughs> so I do want to read it. I think it's going to take me, I need to recover first and then go ahead and read it. But I see there's like a whole list of books in the back. So I'm going to have to read all of them, of course. Um, yeah, but I love it. And I'm just, let me through the pages. Like, am I the only one that loves the smell of books? Love the smell of books. Um, yeah, great book. Absolutely suggest it. This one is really nice because in the back it does have like, what is it? What's it called? Reader's Guide. Introducing the introduction to me before you. And it says conversation with uh, the author. So you get like a little, a peek into the author. And I do really like, I'm trying to see if this has it. I don't it doesn't have it. I do like the books that in the back have like, so it's for like for book clubs or something. So it has like questions you can go through during your book club love love books like that but uh this does have like you know talking to the author and things like that which which is really nice so 
there's that. That's my book review. I'm at five minutes right now, so I need to go because it's supposed to be a quick book review. So that is it. And I will see you guys next time. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Go ahead and leave in the comments if you've read the book or the movie or watched the movie and which one you liked more, things like that. Let's start a conversation and go for it. And don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on anything. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.